Hello, and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to be reacting to Guardsman 2018. This is a Warhammer 40k short film. Uh, this was actually suggested by someone on my Astartes video by Nick Pride. Um, he also recommended Hell's Reach, which I was going to initially react to, but I saw that it's 1 hour, 28 minutes, 45 seconds. Um, and I feel a little bit too... That's a little bit too much for right now. We'll see how these go. Um, if people show interest in, in seeing Hell's Reach, seeing me look at Hell's Reach, I will check it out. Anyway, um, let's jump right into it. This is 4 minutes, 34 seconds, and we are starting now. This is so cool. So cool. gives me chills that was so well done the costume design in this is incredible that's so well put together 
<clears throat> I think the only thing that I the only thing I didn't like that much in this was how light the weapon looks. Like it doesn't it doesn't feel like um doesn't look like it feels like, you know, a proper weapon. It's 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 kind of like it's foam or something. But the rest of it was wow. I loved the atmosphere. I loved the how this is all <clears throat> this is all obviously done in a, one room, a dark room. You've only got this spotlight to see what's going on. You know, you barely see what the uh, the Xenos, I think they called them. <clears throat> you barely got to see what they look like, which I think is great. It kind of uh, calls back to um, Alien and how um, the original Alien movies, they didn't really have a good budget to create a really realistic looking alien, so they purposely kept it in the shadows. So you couldn't see the details of it. And that, I think, works really well. Um, it's It's much better than just seeing it you know, seeing all the details and kind of getting this monster, it's you really want that mystery in there. And I think this this achieved that really well. When the um, I really want to know what these guys are called. Um, where is he? Yeah, these guys. I don't know what they're called. Um, I tried looking up like Warhammer, uh, Marines or like Space Marines. I'm I'm not quite sure. I don't really want to say, oh, it's a Space Marine or something like that, because it's probably wrong. Um, but this costume design is incredible. That is so cool. I would love... <laughs> I would love something like that. I wouldn't even wear it. I just love to have, like... Oh, that's so cool. Look at the light in there as well. Like, he's sort of also in shadow as well. Like You can only see parts of him at one time, which I think is great. It's so well done. I love that costume design. And this guy's eyes, the purple eyes. I don't know why I really like purple. Purple's a really good colour. I think it's under undervalued. That is such a good shot. I'm so impressed by that. That's so cool. I love that. That was really well done. That makes me want to kind of jump into more of this now. Yeah, definitely. Can't believe he only has seventy eight thousand subscribers. Like for something like this, this is like really high quality stuff. Um, I hope he's. Oh, he's the one that did the actual movie as well. It's like uh, an animated one. Interesting. Okay. Hmm. I do want to check that out, but like I said, it is a bit long. And if if there's enough interest in this this type of video, um, I'll definitely check check it out if people want me to check it out. But yeah, I'm going to leave it there. Oh, I'm very impressed with that. Um, if you have any more suggestions, let me know. Uh, again, thank you, Nick Pride, for suggesting this to me. Um, and yeah, if you made it this far, thank you so much for watching. And goodbye.